Hello student. Today I have brought tense for you. There are three types of tense. Present tense, past tense, future tense. Today we will discuss present tense. Present tense has four homes. Simple present, present continuous tense, present perfect tense, present perfect continuous tense. In simple present tense, we use S, E, S with singular persons like he, she, it. We don't use S, E, S with plural like we, I, you and they. Let us take some examples of simple present tense with singular persons as well as with plural persons. With singular persons, he eats, she goes, it plays. And with plural persons, we run, they sing, you dance, I cook. Now, let's talk about present continuous tense. In present continuous tense, we use is, am, are plus verb with ing. Some verbs with ing, do plus ing is doing, eat plus ing is eating, cut plus ing is cutting, run plus ing is running. And in this manner, many more. Let's talk about the uses of present continuous tense with singulars as well as with plurals. With singulars, he is playing, she is reading, it is flying. With plurals, we are running, you are singing, they are dancing. I am writing. I have put I am writing in center because am is special. And it always comes with I. Let's talk about present perfect tense now. In present perfect tense, we use has and have plus third form of verb. With singular, he has, she has, it has. And with plurals, I have, we have, they have, you have. In present perfect tense also, we use third form of verb with has and have. Example of third form of verb are eat is eaten, drink is drunk, sing is sung and in this manner many more. Let us talk about the uses of present perfect tense with singulars as well as with plurals. With singulars, he has played the match, she has done the work, it has broken. He has taken my pen. And with plurals, I have played the match. We have learned the lesson. You have done well. They have gone to Delhi. Now, let's talk about present perfect continuous tense. In present perfect continuous tense, we use has been, have been plus verb with ing. With singulars, for example, he has been, she has been. It has been. And with plurals, for example, I have been, we, we have been, you have been, they have been. In present perfect continuous tense, we also use have with have been and have been plus since or for. For is used when specifying the amount of time, how long. Since is used when specifying the starting point. Let's take some example of present perfect continuous tense with since. For example, she or he has been learning her or his work since morning. I have been cleaning my room since morning. It has been barking since morning. You have been doing your work since morning. They have been living in this house since 1975. Let's take some example of for when in present perfect continuous tense. For example, I have been listening to melodious songs for an hour. She has been reading this book for two hours. They have been playing football for an hour. He has been studying in the library for three hours. We have been shopping at this fair for two hours. Students, I hope. Students, I hope you all are clear with this trends with the help of this video. 
very soon i will bring past tense till then enjoy this video and learn properly thank you